Welcome back, everybody. Here we are in the next town, which is... Something. Hold on. Artisan. Okay, so this is the grass uh, land. So everybody's going to be paired with a grass Pokemon, I'm guessing. So I already saw a funny little Pokemon. There's Sunkern. Another Sunkern. Yeah, so I know they, they said this guy likes uh, art. Oh. There it is. There's the gym. It's going to do a whole cinematic thing because if this is the first one I'm going to, I guess. Arrived at my destination. Let me guess. Nimona is going to be here. Am I going to have to do some art or something? Oh, hello. A lot of people here. Well now, John. You appear to be progressing well on your own gym circuit. What's this now? Is this a, is this that kid I've been hearing so much about? Am I like causing trouble or something? Hey kiddo, I heard you're like way too good at battling, yeah? Yeah. Nah, you got some spear, big shot. This young lady would be Rika. That's me, Rika, here at your service. And hey, I know I'm pretty, but no need to get intimidated or anything. She's a little... Far... Fark... I don't know what that word is. Shall we say? But like myself, she's a member of... Oh, she's a member of the Elite Four. What? I wasn't trying to be funny. Anyway, hmm. Tell you something, kiddo. You look fun. Like, interesting. At a glance, anyway. Naturally, he's one of our Academy's esteemed students. Oh, hi. Huh? Yeah, that checks out. The battles you'll face at these gyms really ratchet up, ratchet up the farther you go. Indeed, your average trainer abandons the challenge at roughly this very point. But not you, right, kiddo? You see, when you hit the champion assessment, you know these gyms what you show these gyms what you got. Best of fortunes to you. Well, now I'm kind of curious if the gym will be. There's a shroomish. <laughs> If the gym is going to be that lower level now. Because they showed up here. So I'm a little curious. But now we've met two of the four Elite Four members. And, um... What's it called? We're about to get our fourth badge. So we'll be halfway to the championship. Or to becoming a champion. A champion, not the champion. Gym test... Sunflora Hide and Seek. City of Artists. Uh, largely inspired by some stuff. Try to take good care of them. I know what Sunflora look like. Okay. You leave the gym, turn right, and you'll see two large Sunflora statues. Head for those. Uh, start for the look at, okay. Oh, they're gonna have fun. Okay, so hide and seek time. Let's go. I'm surprised Nimona's not here. She usually shows up at every gym. Hey, to the Sunflora lawn. I'm guessing not this. Hello. I'm ready. Around the town? Okay. Sun, Sun Flora. Uh, blah, blah, blah. Ten of them. Okay. Is there like a time limit or something? Hello. Yeah, it's what? Alright, there's two. They're not very good at hiding, I see. Sunflora. 
No, you bitch. Don't fucking run from me. I'll fucking kill you. What, I have to battle it? Time to die. Okay, I beat it into submission. Say there definitely has to be more in the maze. Okay, three to go then. following me then? Alright, never mind. Thought that was one on the run. Okay, got you. You're mine. One to go. There it is. Do the sunflower lawn. Okay, that was easier than I thought. Riveting. I think the gym test thing is like interesting, but I'm still like, you know, obviously it's been like that for years where you just fight the extra trainers, but I'm kind of, I like that a lot more, I think. Yes. <clears throat> yes, I am. Straight to the battle court. Because uh, it always got you, like, kind of amped up to see what the trainer's poke, the gym leader's Pokemon was. So, I mean, like, even for, like, Misty, even in, like, the original game and stuff like that, it's like you fight the other trainers and it's like, you know, star you and, like, stuff like that. And then, and then you get up to Misty and then it's a star me, like, that kind of shit. Greetings, challenger. Hark, who's... Hello? Hmm. Hmm. The Dio. You did well to come this far, Jojo. I am Brassius. I am Brassius, an artist specializing in grass type Pokemon. I am also the gym leader here at the Artisan Gym. I was observing your gym test from atop the windmill, you know. The perception you displayed in finding Sunflora was truly... Oh, how shall, shall I describe it? Yes, it was truly avant-garde. I only pray that you might demonstrate that eye for beauty in our battles as well. Enough talk. We must begin creating our collaborative work of art. Why do you have a whip? I trust you are ready. It is time for our masterpiece to take shape.
What is with your eyes, bro? Gym leader Brassius. Oh boy, a little baby thing. What is creation and destruction? Before creation comes destruction. It's Lord Beerus. Oh no, I'm gonna kill him. Mr. Electra, kill him. Hey, bye. <coughs> Petty little. Oh no, not this thing. Smoliv. I feel like the olive roll thing should have been for this guy if it's grass type. One of the most powerful air moves on my side right now. See, this is where we get tricky. Because now he's about to throw in a pseudo wudo. It's promise. This is a this has promise, yes. Whatever you just said. Something artistic. The pseudo wudo's grasp rock. See? Oh, but I guess. Or no, is he just rock? I think that's what always throws me off, is that he's just rock. Let me touch up my work slightly. True, truly Wudo. No, he's using the orb of power. Okay, he just, okay, well now he turned into a grass type. Is gonna do borderline nothing. Oh, da, da. At times, art becomes a race against the clock. Let us increase the pace. Trailblaze. And now he's dead. What a battle! Shudo, Shudo, dies. Is that the sun rising? Did you guys see that? No! Avangade! Damn you! Damn you all to hell! What artistic tactics. It's almost like you use the same move every single time except for that one time and then went back to the first move. <coughs> patterns of your moves the minute so uh, whatever you're you're just talking nonsense I don't really care if I were to judge your work I would say pass the inspection yes a passive exception is proof here's your gym badge shall we take a photo yeah look at epic if you possess four gym badges it will be easier to catch Pokemon at level 40 and those Pokemon should follow your commands as well all right to a fantastic trainer such as yourself, I would also like to offer this, a favorite of mine. Trailblaze. The user attacks suddenly as if leaping out from tall grass. The user's nimble footwork boosts its speed stat. Okay. My inspiration is overflowing. My power is growing. Overflowing. As if it draws from a bottomless well. I will begin on a new piece at once. You must excuse me. Farewell. Goodbye. We are, we're picking up the pace now, folks. Might get through this sooner than I thought. Maybe by like the end of the month, honestly. Is it Nimona? Yeah, there she is. Oh, John, hola. Call you just as you finished up here, huh? Nice work. That puts you four badges in right now. Man, that's awesome. Kill you're halfway through your gym journey already. Your efforts are bearing so much fruit so quickly. It makes me want to just challenge you to battle right here, right now. But I'm going to have to wait. Because I put together my team of Pokemon specifically to take on the gym leader. Dang it. When I battle you, I want to do it under the best possible conditions. Which means this time, I've got to ask for a rain check. Uh, this is the worst timing ever. Sorry. Forgive me. Forgive me. I don't know why she gotta be written like that. She's too hyped up. So with that, grass gym complete. 
which means next is this team Starbase. But there are actually some terror raids on the way. So let's head to the right here. There's the terror raid. There's a Venonat. We got this item. That's a cute little thing, whatever that is, like a fairy Pokemon, I bet. Let me actually real quick. We got some of these. One medium. Okay, let's bring him up one. Epic. Uh, bring up the thirty six. Good at that for now. So we're getting pretty up there in levels. No, wait, I meant to change. Oh, well. I meant to change it to Gabite, but whatever. Let me actually double check when these guys evolve. Uh, okay, so... Go! Very nice. 48? Ah. Uh, is that Fungus? Amoongus? Whatever. Uh, dragon, so yeah. Who's that? So we need to get the 48 for Gabite. And Krokorok evolves into Crocodile at 40. So he's almost there. I could probably boost him up a good deal. I just evolve him already. Uh, but then he'll already be my, my strongest. Alright, time to kill. Whoa, did it. And then he's gonna explode. No. Time to catch this shroom. Yeah. I was gonna say like, oh, maybe I can get Crocodile up there, or not, uh, Croc Rock up there pretty quickly. Um, with the fire base. Like the Team Star one, but at the same time, they're probably so weak, it's not even gonna matter. Ooh, some medium candies? Wow, okay. So, like, but what, like, what the hell? So, are, like, the easier ones, like, to give you more shit or something? Like, how am I getting so many mediums now? Nope, nope. Awesome. Make a good progress, good progress. I mean, again, like, within this one session. We've already banged out two gyms. And a Titan Pokemon.
All right, yeah, I do want to get this terror raid. It's all over here. Now we're really flying. It's actually a lot. All right, we're just gonna cut it here, and because we are getting close to this electric city, right? That's what. Yep, that's the electric city. Um. Yeah, so I'm gonna bang out a bunch of these terror raids. We're gonna jump to the fire base, go to the electric gym, probably. Maybe jump up to the Titan. <laughs> just kind of go around this way, I guess. Oh, no, we're just get, I, like I, I had that plan. I was like, oh, we'll go here, then here. We're just gonna keep going as we go. So, let's uh, do some terror raids, and then when we get back, we'll uh, yeah. So, see you then when we blast through a bunch of terror raids and then just kind of solo the whole game. <laughs> see you next time.